has never been a product just dealing with all acute cardiovascular syndromes. In few words, clear images, straightforward tables, you should be able to bring the right message. I think that's a secret. Uh, it's getting concentrated all the science, all the clinical experience in a very simple way. It provides a framework where you can work as a team. With really clinical answers to real case patients. The European guidelines are the reference, but they are lack, lacking the, uh, the way to apply it uh, on the field. The toolkit is um, uh, a way to, to bridge this, uh, this gap. You see, this is exactly what we need. It's very handy and it's not confusing. It is to get it in the, you know, in the code, you know, here. It's a fast, intuitive and uh, reliable um, guide. Make the best decisions in a few seconds with the ACA toolkit. It's important to have the same uh, approach for all emergency medicine. With this kind of initiative, we will uh, harmonize the practice in the emergency medicine setting. It can help to make decisions very quickly. The toolkit itself will give you a very simple way for the people to have a line. A standardized model of care in the different hospitals. Information uh, on how to, to treat. Implementation, translation. And investigate these uh, patients. The toolkit uh, will add in the education of the physicians that are not dealing on an everyday basis with acute coronary syndrome. We are dealing with septic patients, we are dealing with, uh, with, uh, with kids also, so many things. And sometimes we need really a, t a, 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 a tool like this one to help us to have the good decision. Daily care, patient care at the bedside, education, teaching, harmonization, improving quality of care. Get your ACA Clinical Decision Making Toolkit now. Thank <laughs> you.